Cameron Highlands is one of Malaysia's most popular and well-loved holiday locations thanks to its fresh air, magnificent scenery, and temperate temperature all year round. Plan a relaxing trip here with your significant other, family, or friends to get away from the oppressive humidity of the lower lands. There is so much to see, eat, and do in Cameron Highlands that we guarantee you'll leave feeling refreshed and revitalized. We've put together a list of our top sites to visit and interesting activities to do in Cameron Highlands. 1. BOHT Garden is located in the heart of the city of Singapore. With a refreshing background of green tea fields stretching as far as the eye can view, the BOHT Garden is perhaps one of the most recognizable vistas in Cameron Highlands. A rich history that extends back over a century can be found in the Tea Garden, which also serves as the site of BOH First Tea Factory, which was constructed in the 1930s. While wandering around the gorgeous plantation, travelers may also visit the tea factory, buy souvenirs at the gift store, and enjoy great teas at the cafe, which offers a magnificent view of the surrounding fields. 2. Forest Covered with Moss Ever heard of the enigmatic Mossy Forest, which is hidden away in the peaks of Mount Brinching? Cameron Highlands Mossy Forest, which is blanketed in mesmerizing mist and surrounded by a wonderful atmosphere, is a hidden treasure just waiting to be discovered. This moss-choked woodland, which is located at an elevation of 2,032 meters, appears like something out of a scene from a Lord of the Rings or Avatar movie. It's tough to travel here on your own, so we suggest taking a tour which includes a professional guide, as well as hotel transfers, for a hassle-free and pleasurable vacation. 3. Mount Jassar, interested in working up a nice sweat to start your day off right? Trek your way up Gunam Jassar, a mountain that is famous among nature and trekking enthusiasts around. Despite the fact that the route is not too tough to tackle, you will be rewarded with fresh air as well as uninterrupted views of Tanarata and the Cameron Highlands as a whole from the summit, making all of your efforts worthwhile. 4. Cameron Flora Park is the fourth stop on the tour. Located in Key Farm, an agricultural sector in Cameron Highlands, the Cameron Flora Park is a fresh and beautiful flower garden. Flowers are one of the most beautiful things in the world, so you'll be in for a visual treat at this wonderful place, which is filled with all types of stunning blossoms. In addition to being able to wander about the park on the several pathways and stairwells that wrap through it, guests may have an aesthetically pleasing private picnic against the background of a sea of pink flowers. Make sure to bring your favorite food, put on your finest clothes, and get ready to snap tons of photos at Cameron Flora Park. Cameron Lavender Garden is number 5. More flowers may be found in this area. One of the most famous attractions in Cameron Highlands is the stunning Lavender Garden, also known as Cameron Lavender. The Lavender Garden, which is just a 10-minute drive from Brincheng Town, is packed with not only several varieties of heavenly lavender, but also gorgeous Japanese roses, morning glory, hydrangea, and daisies in a variety of colors and shapes. The garden is also well decorated with charming accessories that are ideal for taking photographs, and it is lined with stores that offer anything from souvenirs to locally produced lavender flavored ice cream, among other things. Key Farm Market is the sixth stop on the list. Key Farm Market, one of the major markets in Cameron Highlands, is a great place to see how the people spend their life. Open for most of the day, this popular market is well known for being a great place to shop for freshly harvested vegetables and fruits, as well as fresh flowers, snacks such as deep-fried sweet potatoes, and a variety of other knickknacks sold by independent traders and farmers from around the world. Make the most of your time at the market by looking around and attempting to get the finest deal you can. Seventh. There is the Sheep Refuge, during your journey around the Key Farm Market, keep a lookout for a large sign depicting a beautiful cartoon sheep. Stop at the Sheep Sanctuary, which is home to friendly fluffy sheep that are just too cute to pass up. Guests are welcome to interact with the sheep, 
which are either housed in well-maintained cages or permitted to walk freely throughout the grounds. A small cafe overlooking the sanctuary is also available for those who are feeling a bit fatigued after all of the touring and would want to sit down and rest their legs. Eight, fruit and vegetable farms. Strawberries are a symbol of the Cameron Highlands alongside great tea and healthy vegetables. The chilly environment in the Highlands makes it the ideal location for growing strawberries all year round. As a result, the Cameron Highlands is littered with expansive strawberry fields, whether in Tanarata, Brinching, or Key Farm. Swing by one of them to get a first-hand taste of handpicking large, luscious strawberries and indulge in strawberry-flavored culinary items such as waffles, ice cream, biscuits, jam, beverages, and more. The Seven Strawberry Farm, Raju's Hill Strawberry Farm, and the Big Red Strawberry Farm are among the most well-known strawberry farms. 9. Cactus Valley, Number 9. Bring home lovely pots of cactus as a keepsake from your vacation, which may be used for personal enjoyment or as a thoughtful present for friends and family members back home. Located on a hillside above Brincheng Town, the Cactus Valley has an enormous collection of cactus, flowering shrubs, and a wide range of other lovely decorative plants. Some of the cactus species found here have never been seen before in other regions of the nation, according to what we've learned. Visit this location to learn about the many cactus species that exist, as well as to bring some back home. Additionally, Cactus Point, a similar nursery situated about two miles outside of Brinchang, is worth a visit as well. Cameron Highlands Resort's Jim Thompson Tea Room is number 10. Want to enjoy a relaxing afternoon tea with your friends? Look no further. Make a reservation at the Jim Thompson Tea Room, which is situated inside the historic Cameron Highlands Resort. There are many wide, open windows, old furnishings, and an overall classic elegance to this exquisite location. Most people come here for their afternoon tea sets, which include a three-tiered assortment of sweet and savory foods or for lunch. Especially if you're planning to travel over the weekend or on a public holiday, we strongly advise making a reservation in advance. Invest in a wonderful lunch and an excellent cup of tea to reconnect with your loved ones. By reserving a stay at the stunning Cameron Highlands Resort, you may elevate your whole experience. 11. Lake House The Lake House, a lovely colonial-style boutique hotel in Cameron Highlands that was also influenced by English history, is another place to visit. It is possible to schedule an intimate stay here or just drop by for a dinner at one of the hotel's restaurants, lounges, or bar, all of which are set in gorgeous garden grounds and have vintage decor a gorgeous venue where you can eat lunch, snacks, or an English-style afternoon tea with scones while soaking in the afternoon sun is the Lake U Terrace at the Lake House. 12. Garden of the Butterflies An other popular family-friendly activity in the Cameron Highlands can be found at the Butterfly Farm, Taman Rama Rama, which is also situated at Key Farm in Brinche. According to the creator, it is one of the oldest attractions in the region, and it all began as a simple pastime to provide a friendly and breeding environment for gorgeous butterflies. Wander around a lovely flower garden full with colorful blossoms and free-flying butterflies and feed peaceful domesticated creatures such as rabbits, ducks, and guinea pigs. Additionally, the Butterfly Garden, which is a newer, comparable butterfly farm situated nearby, offers a similar experience, 